Hey guys, Kenya and Marty Wilhite here with Duffy Homes. We're coming to you from the Whirly Real Estate Network podcast studio. And welcome back to our series on financing, everything financing. Uh, We're talking about the different types of financing and how they work. And today, uh, I think we're going to talk about construction loans, right? Construction loans, right. And who better to do that than our (laughs) resident expert, Todd Hauger. (laughs) Uh, that's perfect setup right there. Construction loans, and they are everywhere these days. All kinds of properties, a lot of investment, a lot of vacation rental constructions going on. Uh, explain to us construction loans and how they're best used. Well, it's a, it's a great question. We have so many people inquiring about those now. And a construction loan is somewhat like the name implies. You're looking to take out a loan um, to have the assets to be able to build a new property. Um, you may already have an existing home. You may have multiple homes, but this is about how do I get a new property built? Um, And one of the things that comes into play is where is that financing going to come from? Do you have to pull equity out of your home or can I get a loan specifically to do this? Right. Okay. Well, what is the difference between buyer versus builder and maybe some time frames? Okay. Well, sometimes the builders are in a position where they will finance the construction of the property. You're going to put some money down typically up front. They will pay for the construction and then you're just going to take out a finished loan when the home is ready to be moved into. Um, But a lot of times the builders aren't excited to do that and they want you to be able to provide that financing. So what you'll do is when you apply for a construction loan, you're going to get a loan that you're going to sign on and close the construction loan up front and you're going to have the assets set aside for you able to build over a certain time frame and as the construction closes out you're going to turn around and turn that into a permanent mortgage um, so that the construction loan gets paid off and turns into a mortgage for you okay so would that be a single close type loan product so there are there are both uh the the Two closing uh, construction loan is what we had seen most in the past, where you completely close on the construction loan right. and you pay typically pay the fees, um, title, and appraisal on those things up front. Mm-hmm. And then when you get closer to completion, you turn around and you do the permanent financing. And a lot of times you would have those title and those appraisal fees hit a second time. But nowadays, what we're seeing more and more of is the single close construction loan product, where you close up front on your construction loan and you're kind of pre-closing for that finished mortgage as well. We don't know the rate yet. But at some point down the road, that rate will be established and it's just with a little bit of work, you'll be able to finish it out and not have to pay all those fees a second time over. That's great. Great information. You're so great at (laughs) explaining this stuff, Todd. I mean, this is why we have you here, because when you talk about financing, it's like breathing to you. (laughs) And it really does make sense when Mm -hmm. you speak about it. And we really appreciate um, what you bring to our table here today. For sure. And it's just another reason why you want a qualified, knowledgeable lender and agent on your side. It's really just one of the most powerful tools you can have in your tool belt uh, when purchasing a property. And we're so thankful to have uh, this kind of knowledge in the room today. Thank you so much. And thanks, everybody, for watching. If you've got questions, just give us a call.